We saved the best for last. <laughs> uh, Vanderbilt. <laughs> so Vanderbilt, tough schedule for Vandy. Um, they start the season playing Virginia Tech, and then they got Alcorn State. They go to Georgia State. Uh, they got Missouri after that. Um, they host Alabama. They go to Kentucky. <laughs> so they got to go to Missouri and then to Kentucky uh, on either side of that hosting Alabama game. Then they get a little river respite and they play uh, <coughs> uh, Nickel State, or excuse me, Ball State. Then they host Texas. Then they go to Auburn, host South Carolina, go to LSU, and then host Tennessee. How many wins do you see on this for Vanderbilt? Well, somebody needs to educate the athletic director at Vanderbilt that you're allowed four non-conference games in the SEC, and you're supposed to schedule four wins when you coach at Vanderbilt. Um, scheduling Virginia Tech was a really bad move. I see them going mm -hmm. three and nine. So I have them going two and 10. <laughs> you think Georgia only, State's going to get them too? I, I think they are. I have Georgia yeah. State beating them at Georgia State. I think they lose that game. It. I could see and, it. And uh, because it's a weird environment, you're going into it with an old Turner field. So it's not even a football stadium. Yeah. Um, so it's going to be a weird feeling anyway. And I think Georgia State beats them. Uh, so I got them going two and 10 with their only wins against Alcorn State and Ball State. That's it. Uh, that's that's tough. That's tough sledding there for them. Uh, just a man in Tennessee said 0-12. <laughs> I, I like it. That's pretty good. Caleb Wonkare said 2-10. and 10. Carl said Vandy SEC champs. They got us all hoodwinked. <laughs> Two people agree with Carl in the SEC yeah. media days. <laughs> Two people legit voted for Vandy as SEC champs. I mean, that's got to be a joke, right? Like, they should have their credentials removed because you can't just joke around about that. <laughs>